for the fight of my life Hit my knees and I strap on my gloves Boy, I've been prepping since like I was seven And thank you so much, I'm covered in blood Walking in love, this for the ones who've been stuck in the mud Searching for hope, trust me, I know what it feel like to drown in my pride all right guys after like 45 minutes of trouble with another four-wheeler we eventually just figured out a way and we made it like a mile away to this creek system where we killed a snake a long long time ago so let's see if we can get any snakes um out of this creek so Stay tuned. Guys, we just spotted our first snake. I'm gonna take a shot. Okay, I think he tucked his head up under. So I'm gonna shoot as high as I can by the head. Oh. He went way up into the grass, fast. Wow. He probably went into a hole. Okay guys, so. Too bad we don't have our spear. Otherwise, I could have just pinned him to the bank and we could have just finished him off. I was not expecting him to scale the bank like that easily. That was, but yeah, let's keep moving, guys. Guys, we found wild raspberries. Look at that. John says they're mulberries, but if you know, well, I, I saw... drop it down in the comments down below if yeah, you know. Yeah, I, I know. I just Look saw... how many are right there. I saw the black one first. First thing I saw was mulberries. Super cool. I'm gonna eat one. Yeah. They're super ripe. All right, guys, we found a nice little, probably red-eared slider, trying to corral some minnows for dinner. Here we go. That's dope, dude. Check that out. Trying to claw me. Super healthy, guys. This is how I like to do it. Just like that. Just from the bottom, they can't claw you, can't kick you or anything. He's happy. <laughs> we'll let him go. Let him live another day. All right, guys. It keeps going. The trees start to close in. We found another red-eared slider. Where'd he go? Crap, I can't see him through the mud. Oh, he's right there. Pick him up. Here, hold my pistol. Hold up. Turtle number two, baby. If we can catch him. Oh, crap. Crap, I can't. Just gotta grab him. They really, oh. Oh, there's another one. Wow. There's that one right there and the one that John's messing with. You just feel around with your feet, like a uh, snap. Oh, there he goes. So what he's doing right now is he's burrowing himself up in the bank. Honestly, this, that's all poison ivy. I don't want to really mess with him. We've already caught one. But yeah, that's pretty cool. Three turtles and one snake. All right, guys. So it is like insanely hot out here. I'm like sweating like crazy. I'm not getting any air. It's like super humid. Uh, just still out hot. It's 93 and it feels like 102. So we saw one little snake. If we had the spear, we would have got him, but we tried guys. We went eh, a mile down the creek. All right guys, John was walking back across the road and we got a snake, so. He's right there. So we're just gonna do what we can. Oh, I think I got him in the head. Oh, he's pissed. He's pissed. He's pissed. Oh my gosh. No, John. <laughs> John. Oh, no, no, he's getting away. Jumped and ran away. I don't know where that sucker went. Here, let me get on this side. See him? No. Guys, I'm telling y'all right now, if we had a spear, it would have been game over for that guy. I don't know where he went. I think he went up under that tree. Or up under that root right there. Later. What's up, guys? We're about to go fishing. We're going to see if we can catch anything. May or may not cook it. We don't know yet. We got Ethan here. Yep. And we got my broken fishing reel that is no longer in service right now. So I've just, all I have is my ultralight. Hopefully the line doesn't snap. 
Hopefully I don't lose too many fish. Got the rooster tail on there. And I think we're all set. So we're just gonna head out to the pond and I'll have the GoPro on, so we'll see you there. All right guys, we didn't get on camera, but first fish of the day, John just caught a nice little one pound. Good sized bass. Good job, man. No, I was, he was, it was about by the shallows and then all of a sudden he started tugging. Yeah. At first I thought it might've been caught, but then I saw the rod like bang. Yeah, we're catching it, Lucy. Nice. Oh, Ethan had one just came off. He's fishing top water, so top water is always harder. The bass will jump and do anything they possibly can to get that thing out of their mouths. Guys, I stepped on this tree to get over it. We're trying to get to the next fishing spot and a baby deer comes out from under it because I guess I shook the tree to where it scared it and he ran like right over here. Where? Up on He's the up on the hill. Where are we going? Oh, really? He's going that way. That way. Wow. All right, he's gone. I thought he was right here the whole <laughs> Yes, sir. Final. Second, third cast? Yeah. Don't snap it. Don't snap it. Decent size. Decent size. No, throw him out there because he'll get stuck and die. Uh -huh. Throw him way out there. That was really bad. Hopefully he makes it. <laughs> All right, guys, they're on fire right now. We're getting hits every other cast. We're just going to have to wait and see. Guys, I missed the hook set, but got him. It's, it's, not, it's not too big, but let's go. Finally a fish, guys. He's actually pretty big. He's still a fish, though. Woo! Got him. Let's go, baby. That looks like the exact size of the one you just caught. Yeah. Let's go. Second or third fish of the day. Release him. And we got the National Guard flying over. Pretty low. It was kind of weird how he hit that, guys. He almost just cruised up to it and just politely got it like that. Gave me plenty of time to set the hook. So. Oh, dude. Oh, dude. So that's, that's literally happening every other cast. It hits the water and... Something smaller is taking it under. Okay. Jeez, dude. Almost missed it. He's a little guy. Yank him in here, dude. He's only like six inches. No, it's a bass. Yes, sir. I think that's a small guy that's like barely missing us. That's the one that's probably been tapping everything. Quick release. Oh, no. Fish four, maybe. Oh, that's a good one. Dude. All right, guys. We are calling it a day. We caught a couple fish. Each one of us caught one. It's good enough. Better than nothing. Is yeah. actually picking me up? Yeah. No, uh huh? Yeah, it is. All right, ready? Rick! 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 Like, I don't know why I'm so scared. Literally, it's water. What's gonna happen to me? Was that it? Wow! Let's go, baby! 
baby. Guys, I'm telling you, this may look cheesy or sound cheesy, but guys, anything you put your mind to, you can freaking do it. Let's freaking go, baby. Why is it so easy, guys? Guys, tell me why getting up on the diving board and doing a backflip after not doing one in two and a half years is easy, guys. You guys can do it. Go face your fears right now. It just kind of opens your eyes on what you're, what you're capable of doing, so. Peace.